Hey everybody, this is Ku Impact with Let's Play Dark Cloud 2! Oh, we're starting the actual dungeon. Holy crap, the underground channel floor 1. To the outside world. Well, they call floors episode... Well, it says floor info, but when you get in there, it says episode... 1. Yeah, I don't know. What does this think it is? A show or something? Uh All those medals you see right there? We won't be getting them until much later in the game. I'm guaranteeing it. Has Ku ever collected 100% medals? No. Has Ku ever gotten to 90% medals? No. Has Ku ever gotten to 50% medals? Once. Oh god, Donnie. Oh Jesus, I just got into the dungeon. It's like a maze. Could get lost pretty easy here. It's not a maze. It's a rogue. There's a difference. Well, Rogue likes they're they're like this. The map uncovers itself unless you find the floor map, and then you can see what the whole floor pattern is. It helps, but it doesn't at the same time. Looking for the exit is the only thing that's like tough. How does he know this if he's never been into the channel himself? Really, Donnie, I I don't understand how you know these things. Roger, Donnie. I'll give it a try. Roger, Donnie. Roger, Roger. Roger Wilco. No, we're done that game. I miss it already. It was such a funny game. Yeah, like I said, the metal holder and the medals, we'll be getting them in a later video. Right now we focus on just continuing the story, leveling weapons, things like that. Collecting items and chests. Flame crystals aren't that bad to start with, but none of my weapon really need flame, I think. So it saddens me. We'll just save them for somewhere else. So by holding the 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 L the L uh, I mean the R1 button and then picking them up you uh, and then hitting the attack button, you can pick things up like those crates. They usually contain items that are useful, like ride pod fuel and bread. Ah, uh, still none. Or you can throw them at enemies to stun them, which comes in handy because when an enemy is stunned, it drops an item. Or if you kill the enemy with the gun or the secondary weapon of the other person. This game supports a four character system, well, a five character system. Two main characters, two sub tanks, and a support. Which will come in handy later. I think I dropped that item into the water. I shouldn't have done that. Oh, there's an item. An antidote drink. I forgot they could drop that. Yeah, so smash the random things around, even if it's time-consuming. It'll help you gather items that you need, such as bread and everything. It could save your life, essentially. Starting off with more repair powders is nice. It's being generous to Ku today. You can hit select to make the map bigger, disappear forever, or the mini-map. Which, we'll be using the mini-map, because I don't want the big map getting in the way of you guys. Usually I play with the big map. There are a lot of enemies in this room, only because the clowns, like, home in on you. So, I'm gonna get beaten to death. That might happen. Oh, he poisoned me. See, you notice I didn't freak out about the poisoning here, because this game, it's easy to deal with. Yeah, you know what, I was, I was gonna try to level the freaking... There we go. I don't know, it looks like this run gun is going to be like the more leveled weapon at this point. Oh, 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 no, face the other way, Max. I thought you were... Ah, uh, he didn't home in on him correctly. What the hell? Usually when you home into something, it'll turn towards them, but uh, apparently that didn't work this time. I'm going to eat a bread. I, uh, just as a safety precaution, of course. It's not like not eating a bread would have been necessary. Fuck you, rat. Oh, really? Really now? Stop hopping in place. You don't get the glorifiedness to hop in place like that. That's Crazy Pika's job. That's for you. I'm gonna beat the hell out of you. You're a clown. Fancy acrobatics we have. Ow. I should have not done that. I could have dodged his knife and then charged up. All this to try to level my freaking main weapon. Wow, I already need another bread. Good thing I broke all those boxes with bread in them. 
So this game consists of a variety of enemies, and it works by the system on later on the game we'll see similar enemies, but with different names and stronger stats. Hey, we have leveled up our first weapon. What it explains here is you can synthesize things into your weapon, which you need to to upgrade it. They're... Via the build up button. Now, I'm going to be going the top path, not the bottom path, because... Top path requires more work equals better weapon. It requires a beast, which I got a hunter crystal just now to actually uh, synthesize into it, but I still have synth points left over. So you can see I have four total. Every level up for wrench is four. Every level up for sword is three. Every level up for gun is four. No, three. And every level up for armlets, five synth points. You can actually accumulate a lot of synth points and then synthesize a, a mass amount of crystals into your thing or whatever you're synthesizing practically everything including your other weapons you own can be broken down into it now if you're going to do other weapons there's a precaution to this you could break your we your current weapon if you don't have that weapon leveled up to plus five right now i have a plus one and a plus zero so you get how that works all right more antidote drinks now i can go and get poisoned again Luckily, the earlier floors of most dungeons don't have mimics. Most dungeons. The last one does, however. Last two. There'll be always mimics on every floor, so you'll have to be careful. Got some destruction crystals right there. We can add that to the wrench and actually make it more powerful, because I need smash and I need beast to level it up. But I'd rather wait. Here's a chance time. Now, I always take the chance times. Who's the guy who likes to take a chance? These can end up bad or good. It ended up bad for us, so we take lots of health damage. Great. And then a clown's coming. How he avoided. See, and that's how you deal with the clown. He throws his knife, and then you approach him. And yeah, lag. Lots of lag. You know what? I'm going to spectrumize these just because my weapon needs it. Crystals are worth three. Items are worth two and one. You want to synthesize crystals top because they do that. Rare gems are worth a random amount of points depending on what the gem is. Like opal is like a whole bunch of shit. And diamond is five to everything except for attack and durability, which it's ten. Diamonds are awesome, but rare. Very rare. And I'd rather waste my diamond on something else. Because I need three diamonds by the end of this. Now look back at me, and now look at you, and now look at Max, and now look back at yourself. Now look at the screen, and it's filled with diamonds. That question mark on the map is a heal point, which would have been useful if I knew it was there, because then I wouldn't have to eat all that bread. We're going to try to level the gun up. I say try because enemies that are mobile like this tend to dodge gun bullets very easily. Meaning I have to repair the gun. But uh, I, I think the gun deserves a level up just as much as the uh, wrench. Now shoot him to death. Shoot him, Max. Shoot him. And killing things like with the gun, like I said, you can get extra items out of it. I get poisons from them, guys, which is the Giorama part. For those who don't know what the Giorama is, we'll get to that when we get to that. That's a little later in the game. But I had to mention that there are Giorama parts that you can even collect as early as this. I'm going to come back when I take damage to use that thing. Now remember I got a channel key earlier in this dungeon. That's That door over there needs a channel key to get into. It's a sub door. There's usually one per floor, per floor if it's randomly generated. Meaning that one chest will have the sub door key. I had one time the sub door key behind the sub door. So that area was completely inaccessible. I was lucky that the monster that had the uh, key out, the handle, wasn't behind it. Oh, you see what I mean? It's like I'm firing directly at that guy, yet since he's hopping, I can't hit him. There we go. Killed the hell out of those guys. I got a sugar cane from the clown. Suga cane. Yeah, you dead. You dead. There are some weird things out there, folks. Weird things. Go play Octo Dad. Then you know what I'm talking about. 
And all monsters defeated, by the way. You get that little thing, and then this music plays when all the monsters are dead on the floor. Meaning you can leave for free, or you can advance for free. Oh, a gun repair powder. Holy crap, that's awesome. And a normal repair powder. The game is giving me gifts from the heavens. Now I say we have enough time to do one more floor, since this floor only took me ten minutes. It's gonna be the usual here. Well, no. No, it's not. Lots of floors later are gonna take long. These are easy. Ku tries to get a wipe out of all monsters, but if he has to run for the exit because low on supplies and he has the key, he's I not going to hesitate. Oh, shh. Channel. I had said I want to see the outside world to Donnie, but there was a second reason why I wanted to go there. Oh, really now, Max? Oh, no, Max's dad. See, I told you he was a royalty or nobility or something like that. Your flounder, sir. Bon appetit. Bullshit! He gets flounder for dinner and Ku has to eat ramen? Oh. Ah. Lucky ba He's not even touching it. Max, where are your manners? Eat your dinner. Look at his cool hair and beard. Father, I'd like to ask you something. Yes? What is it? What do you want of me, oh, my son? It? Where is she? About his mom. <laughs> Your mom. I'm sure I told you this. Arthur already. joke. Your mother is doing important work far away from here. But what's the name of the town and what job is she doing there? I really want to say some jokes about it's this, but it would about. spoil the game. And some people haven't seen it yet, so. This is just how you always are. You don't tell me anything. Oh, he's going through his rowdy preteen years. You know, his testicles are dropping. He's learning to fire his first gun. Yes, he's beating things. He's beating clowns up with a wrench. Go after him, sir. Leave him be. Look, if he doesn't eat his flounder, I'll eat it. How are you going to reach it from across the table? I will find a way. Yeah, his dad's sort of a sort of a jerk. He really is. Next floor time, after I save, of course. Oh, I think we could get the next floor done, because that wasted two minutes. I forgot that cutscene existed. We would have had more time to do this next floor. Maybe we can get lucky and all the monsters are, like, in one room. I've gotten that once before and got the wipeout time, just because they were all in one room. Damn this random generator. Shakes fist angrily in the air, because I'm Ku Impact. And when Ku is pissed, babies cry. The world shakes, volcanoes erupt. The moon fucking explodes. But in the meantime, let's battle with some rats. Oh, fun. The floor starts out with two frogs. This is not the Caro 9 Destiny. Caro 9 Destiny. Caro. It's Caro. It's not Caro. Why do some people say Caro? They're doing it wrong. I'm making the wrong jokes for the wrong LP, damn it. That's a bat, not a rat. Why is that here? This is not Demon Castle Dracula either. Stop thinking it is. So if you didn't realize this by now, bats are weak to gun by a lot. Use gun to kill them, not wrench. You'll regret it. It's a good way to level gun anyways. Ooh, a hunk of copper. Ooh, a piece of candy. You acquire a candy. Oh, this is fun. I seen that coming from a mile away, yet I still did it anyways. I was hoping it was a poison trap. Actually, if that was a weapon destroying trap, I would have been freaking screwed. Ain't you pretty full? Oh, a rolling log is good. That's a barren balloon. They're supposed to look like, you know, flotsam. And they're really weak to gun. More than the bats. Whoa. Sorry, guys. VLC decided to open up, so I had to do some edit work there. It was some jer that was some jerk-ass move that it decided to just randomly freaking open up. I, I don't know. I don't understand it either. It makes me sad. 
It also brought lag to my screen like hell. So if you're seeing lag right now, I'm seeing lag right now. Hopefully the audio is not desynced. I'm gonna beat the hell out of you, rat. See, as I said, this is a floor where you... Oh, I got the key handle. Awesome. I can go to the next floor. I don't have the time for the next floor. Classes are soon. I better hurry. Who needs to get to those classes of his? He does exist in a college, you know. Oh, not another. I'm gonna guess it's a weapon destroying trap. Of course it's a poison trap. Yeah, thanks. And that wasn't even that good of a prize. If it was a different weapon, then I would have been happy. Even if Max can't use it. I've gotten weapons like that before. <laughs> I gotta remember to sort the inventory next time I start. Oh, but this gives me an opportunity to show off the heal point. Instead of eating bread and wasting my bread supply, heal to full. I don't know, I don't remember if it cures poison in this game. I know in the old game it would cure your status ailments too. Because every time I'd get sticky, and I didn't have a soap on me, so I'd have to run back to that if there was one on the floor. And if there wasn't, I just ran around slowly. Dark Cloud 1 and 2 actually have very different engines. I'm playing two because it's more, you know, story-oriented, and people seem to want to see this one more anyways. Plus, I don't own Dark Cloud 1. I'm only borrowing Fave, uh, Fades 430's one. Which reminds me, I have to give it back to him soon. The magic crystal will show you the enemies on the map. I'm pretty sure we realized this already. I mean, I didn't explain it in the, the dungeon floor before, but you could have read it on the screen. Whoa, 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 whoa. Audio skipping. Stop skipping. How many more enemies are left? Oh, only a few? Sure, we can take care of them all then before I have to go. We can get this done. We can do this. We're men. We're women. We're strong. We are a people. We are an army. God damn it, stop pausing on me, game. No, really. Unpause. What the hell? D d oh, there. Something's going wrong with my controller. Sure you wanna... Okay, it wants to work now, I guess. I don't know. It stopped doing what it was doing. Here's a chest. Here's some repair powders. Alright, I'm stocked. I'm ready to go rape some shit with my main weapon. Yay! Rape! But he's the last guy on the floor. All monsters are killed! Right. That takes care of you guys. Me and Max are on fire today. Two cleared floors in one vid. Oh, Jesus. Fine. Ooh, another wrench! I could use that. Yeah, yeah, I know. Could run to the pool of water, but hey, it would waste time. And there's the map. Yeah, I could smack that chest all day for being this direction instead of the one I went. How do I... how do I get over there? Oh, I see. For a second there, I didn't know how to reach that exit. I was like, what the... Her? Who uh, zoned out there? He didn't realize what he was doing. Ah, uh, I have to finish this soon. So let's get the saving. Are you William? Are you William Holden? Was William Holden at the party last night? Save the game. So this has been Ku Impact with Let's Play Dark Cloud 2. Don't forget to subscribe, rate, and comment next time. We go deeper into the underground channel, fight a bunch more monsters, and might return to floor one to restock our stuff if we run low. And level our weapons some more, of course. More Hunter and Smash Crystals, the better. I gotta start working on gun as well. So I will see you guys all next time. Do, 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 do.